Hello everyone, Bentley K here. Welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video. Today's video is a fun Friday video and I thought we would try the new fad, which is the heatless curls. So that's what we're gonna do today. And I am just going to be copying several videos that I saw. But anyways, you start off, you need a robe tie. So that's what I have, I have my robe tie. I have a bobby pin for it, and then I have this. So let's just get started. First thing we wanna do is we wanna split it down the middle. Pull it in front and then brush it out. I did wash my hair this morning so it's nice and dry, nice and clean. So let's just brush all this out. real quick. Hopefully this is fast. I think it's supposed to be fast. Seems like it was pretty fast when I watched videos. I normally do not brush my hair because it makes it frizzy. But hopefully the curling will tame the frizz. So that's how you do that. And then I'm going to take this and I'm going to tie this up just to get it out of my way. Because I don't want it to get caught in these when I do them. And I'm gonna tuck this in there too. Okay, so to start off with, you wanna take your, I'm sure you guys have all seen this a thousand times already. You take your robe and you, you fold it in half and then where the fold is, that's where you wanna put it on your part. I think it's a little too far back. Just like that. And then I'm just gonna put a bobby pin in it to keep it in place until I get it done. So it looked really easy when other people did it. Hopefully it is. Basically you take a layer of hair from the top, just like this. And you just wrap it around this guy. Just like that. Except that I got some of this hair down here caught in it. So just like that. And then you want to keep it pretty tight. Because the tighter you can keep it, the tighter your curl's gonna be. And then you take another piece of hair, and I want to go all the way to the part. Grab a piece of hair. And I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm just gonna go around this robe piece. Nice and tight. I wanna keep it aimed backwards. And I'm gonna add a piece to here. And do it again. Go around. And 
this way, all the way around. And then grab some more hair from back here. Add it to here and go around and then do it again here add it and go around back here and go around piece to here and go around I'm going to cut part of this out. Then I'm going to add all the rest to this piece. I'm going to go all the way around. And then you just finish it off by going the rest of the way down. I hope this turns out. I've never done this before, so... Okay, I'm going to stop right there, and I'm going to put one of these little elastics on it.
And that is what you do. As far as I know, that's it. So now I'm going to do this side. Okay, this side is not as good. This one is much tighter, but oh well, we're gonna leave it for this time. We can take the bobby pin out now. And then you're supposed to take it back, cross it, bring it over and tie it. And then we can tuck this in back here somewhere. Like that. And we are good to go till morning. Because now you sleep on it. And we'll see how it looks tomorrow morning. So I will be back in the morning. Okay guys, I'm back. It's the next day. And we're ready to take this down. So... And I'm telling you right now, it was not fun sleeping on it. And I slept on it down. And it still, it was awful. And frankly, I don't see how it's going to possibly work. Just saying. Because I didn't put any product on my hair at all. To make it curl. It wasn't wet. So... Hopefully it works, but I don't know. And I don't even know if it's worth it because, I mean, all this trouble and the no sleep last night, I think I'd rather just curl my hair, but we'll see. Okay, we'll start over here. It looks like it's got some curl. And this one didn't go very well. See, look how long. I should have pulled these tighter up here. I don't know how I got so messed up on this side. But hopefully it's still good. Because that's the bottom, right? Nobody's going to see that. I know they said to unroll it carefully so that you don't get extra frizz and we don't want extra frizz I'm used to extra frizz though well it's got some nice waves and they actually feel like they'll last longer than like ones you had to use heat for. But we'll see. So what do you guys think? I had to get that off my head. All right, I am going to go mess with it 
and put on some makeup and then I'll come back and let you see and we can figure out if it's worth it because at this point I'm not really sold that it's worth it you know what I mean just seems like a lot more trouble than just curling your hair so I'll be back okay guys this is our look with the hair curls I'm not sold I thought it was too much trouble I'd rather just curl my hair when I want it curled so anyways this is our TikTok review of the no heat no heat hair which is a good thing you know no heat but it's got some lumps in it and I, know, I mean maybe it's just the way I did it because I saw other people that looked magnificent but this was the good side and it it's not that good either you know what I mean and all I did was turn it upside down and run my fingers through it so I'm not that impressed so I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe before you leave and hit that little notification bell so you're notified every time I upload a new video follow me on Facebook Twitter and Instagram I love you guys I appreciate you guys so much thank you for watching my videos and I'll see you in my next video Mwah!